Another matter is now unsafe. Abortion is a public health concern in Nigeria, accounting for 13% of maternal deaths to stem the tide and give women and girls improved health conditions. Lagos State has now launched its own guidelines on safe termination of pregnancy for legal indications. Sarah Yeko has more. Annually, Nigeria records about 10.3 million pregnancies. One in five of these pregnancies end in abortion. This is approximately 1.9 million abortions every year, with 72% of them being unsafe. These concerns were raised at this event to re-echo and simplify the legal angle of safe abortion. Whose law should be law? We have a problem of a multi diverse society with different moralities, different value systems, and we're constantly contending. In 2018, Nigeria launched national guidelines on unsafe termination of pregnancy for legal indication. To domesticate this guideline, Lagos State has launched its own guidelines to further provide required skills, training, and evidence-based data for health workers. Abortion in Nigeria is not legal, as most people think. It is actually restrictive. However, significant number of healthcare providers are unaware of the legal indication for self-termination of pregnancy. The policy is a demonstration of the commitment of Lagos State Government to improving maternal health, especially mitigating the impact of unsafe abortion practices in the state. Lagos State government has now modified its own law to say that apart from saving one's life, there is also the physical health of a woman. The four-year journey towards domesticating Lagos State's guideline on unsafe termination of pregnancy for legal indication has been facilitated by the Lagos State Ministry of Health. It's about making it clear and empowering the health workers on in which situations they can actually intervene and terminate a pregnancy. It's about knowing and educating our health workers about what situations they can legally uh, terminate an abortion. It is definitely not uh, stating that, oh, abortion has become legal. With the launch of these guidelines, the Lagos State Government hopes to engage various stakeholders at different levels, from the law enforcement agencies to legal practitioners to community leaders for proper dissemination and better understanding of these guidelines to reduce maternal mortality. Sarah Yeku, TVC News, Lagos.